Hi guys, Graham here again from Bainbridge Technologies. This is the fourth and last in this series about the uh, slimline lithium battery. Um, basically a little bit of a tech talk. Uh, I've touched on some of the other features, the DC to DC charger, the BMS and um, the thermal protection and so forth. Today uh, I'd just like to quickly you know, just uh, fill you in on the actual battery cells themselves that we use. So in the slimline um, batteries and all our batteries for that matter, we use uh, tier one top of the range prismatic cells. Now the prismatic cell itself, um, in this video we'll put a little drop um, screen in and actually show you a picture of the cell by itself uh, and the diagram, but basically there's four cells within here and they're 110 amp hour cells um, at uh, 3.2 volts, hence why it becomes then a 12.8 volt battery. So the prismatic cell themselves are a five millimeter thick aluminium cased uh, cell, so they're very robust within their own uh, their own right, and also thermal protection and thermal properties, being the aluminium dissipates heat better than say the plastic style of one. Um, the other main battery cells on the market that some people are using in their their batteries are pris uh, not prismatic cells but cylindrical cells, and there's a couple of different types of cylindrical cells as well. The most common is the 1680, which basically looks like a double A style of battery and they literally run hundreds of them all like soldered together with one little strip and soldered so all it takes is for one of those little batteries to work its way loose or the solder to break or the ribbon to break and your base your battery is basically inoperative because it's you know whatever cell in line it stops there so um, by having the four cells in this obviously eliminates a lot of that issue. It also is because it's designed and engineered and made here in Australia, we've made it for Australian conditions, hence why it's an aluminium cased, aluminium prismatic cells. The cells are lined up standing like one, two, three, four, and then there's a solid brass buzz bar that goes across the top with M8 thread bolts that bolt down into each battery. So it's really heavy duty. Um, it's not just going to work its way loose with, um, you know, little spot welds and so forth, tacking them together. So it's it's something that we uh, take pride in um, as far as the, um, the longevity of the battery cells and how the battery is actually put together inside. So that said, that also takes into consideration the, uh, the life cycles of the battery. So as I said, the, the battery is guaranteed for 5,000 cycles, which is going to be longer than you and I'll be on this planet for, even if you discharged it, um, you know, a couple of times a week, that's, you know, once, twice a week, that's a hundred chart, that's a hundred cycles a year, basically. So that's, you know, 20 to 30 years worth of, um, life out of this battery, even on, at the, using it to its uh, longest depth of discharge. So hopefully that's giving you a little bit more insight into our batteries and the, the makeup um, and the products used and uh, how they're put together. So uh, until next month, uh, which will be next week, we'll be on a whole new topic and um, you know, hopefully we'll give you a bit more insight into some of our other products as well. So bye for now, see you then.